Hey guys and girls, welcome to your second HTML5 inline SVG tutorial and to, which is the part of ifectioner.com HTML5 and CSS3 tutorial series and now we would be discussing about the difference between the graphics which we create using the canvas tag and the graphics which we create in the SVG format. So you guys would uh, be saying, hey iFactioner, I know that we can create the graphics in canvas tag and now you are telling us that we can also create the graphics in the SVG format. So what is the difference? Because we can create the same circles, rectangle, lines, uh, polygons and polylines in the canvas tag, then why do we need SVG? Well, the answer lies in the quality. For this, we would be seeing two live examples and uh, uh, in these two examples, these graphics have been created in the canvas of HTML5 and these graphics are created in SVG. So, the first difference is that the graphics which we create in Canvas are raster based graphic. You can say it's a, uh, uh, say it is raster based or raster based. So, it's raster based graphics which means that these graphics or shapes which I have created in uh, canvas tag they have been created in the dot format so a lot of little dots have been uh, combined to make these shapes these shapes are in the bitmap, bitmap format so when we zoom them in not zoom out but zoom in you will see that they start to lose their quality and we can see that uh, those uh, dots uh, started to appear in our picture in other words the quality of picture is depreciated whereas images created in canvas are raster based the images created in SVG format are vector based graphics they are called scalable vector graphics because we can scale them in zoom them in or scale them out zoom them out and they will not lose the quality they are created using lines paths and curves that is why when I zoom my uh, graphics which are created in SVG they do not lose the quality uh, because they have been created in a uh, vector graphics format and uh, the other difference between the graphics created in canvas and the graphics created in SVG format or the difference between the canvas and the SVG is that if I need to animate an image or a part of uh, 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 the graphic in canvas then I have to redraw the whole canvas and this means a lot of work for your processing machine that is your computer whereas if I would like to redraw or re animate my images in SVG then I only need 
to change the dimensions or the x and y properties with the width and height of that graphic and that's all that means less processing for the computers so it is advisable to animate your graphics in SVG format and uh, uh, we can make games which are more efficient in SVG format than in canvas the number three uh, difference between the canvas and the SVG is that SVG graphics are or the SVG files are made in the XML format whereas our canvas graphics are drawn using the script thing language and mostly we use JavaScript so it also means uh, that in some ways the computers have to process more in case of the canvas element as compared to SVG element so these are the three main differences between the SVG and another difference is that SVG has been in the scene since 1999 or you can say 1998 whereas the canvas element is the new element which has been uh, introduced in HTML5 and it was not present in HTML4 or XHTML and uh, uh, the new thing about SVG file is that now we can use the inline code inline SVG to develop our uh, SVG graphics in the HTML5 file and we would be doing that in our next tutorial so thank you very much for joining me this tutorial in which we have discuss the difference between the canvas and SVG. See you in the next iFactioner.com video tutorial. Take care. Bye bye.